There's images of the universe like we have never seen before. James Webb Space Telescope has brought a new era of space exploration, providing us with shocking information about the mysteries our universe holds. JWST isn't your typical telescope. It is a masterpiece, the largest and most advanced telescope ever built. It has a mission to take us back to the origins of the universe, allowing us to witness the cosmic events as they happened billions of years ago. And when I say billions of years ago, I'm not joking. With its unconventional technology, the JWST can go back to the time when the universe was just 200 million years old. The JWST was built to focus on four main areas, studying the universe's first light, surveying the formation of galaxies and stars in the early universe, investigating the birth of stars and planetary systems, and conducting a comprehensive study of planets, including their potential to support life. These areas are crucial for space exploration, but observing distant space objects with precision has been challenging. The JWST had to undergo various science and calibration tests before it could start its space observations. One important step was unfolding its massive sunshield, a five-layered membrane designed to protect the telescope's delicate instruments from the sun's intense heat and light. The shield is essential for its protection, since the telescope will be traveling through space indefinitely. Unfurling the sunshield required careful attention to ensure each layer was correctly tensioned and aligned. This was an important step because even the tiniest of misalignments or damage to the sunshield would have proven to be a huge barrier to the telescope's potential to observe distant objects. Thankfully, the JWST passed this step flawlessly and the progress was visible. The next important step towards sending it up into space was to make sure the telescope stayed in the right position. This test involved powering up the telescope's instruments one by one to see if they were working properly. These instruments included the near-infrared camera, the near-infrared spectrograph, and the mid-infrared instrument, each with unique capabilities for studying the universe. Over 300 universities, organizations, and companies from 29 US states were involved in this remarkable project. Yet again, the JWST passed this test, and it was in the right spot. JWST's main mirror includes 18 hexagonal pieces that must be accurately put together to form clear images. Setting up the telescope involves several crucial steps. First, the sun shield had to be unfolded, the support structure extended, and the main mirror gradually deployed. Once everything was set, the mirror required precise tuning to achieve the exact alignment crucial for scientific observations. Even the smallest mistake in this course could put the over $10 billion investment at risk. Additionally, it was important to make sure that it could point at and track objects in space. All these tests were crucial for JWST to begin its mission. And normally, in such an important and expensive experiment, things don't always go your way. But the fact that JWST passed all these tests flawlessly is just remarkable. After clearing all the tests without any problem, the James Webb Telescope was sent into space on December the 25th, 2021 using a European Ariane 5 rocket. After more than 30 years of planning and development, costing over $10 billion, the launch of such a complicated device into space always carries risks. But thankfully, everything went smoothly for this mission as well. After traveling for about a month and covering nearly a million miles, the JWST reached its assigned position in space, known as L2. This location is stable due to gravity and is strategically positioned opposite the Sun about Earth's orbit. Many other space telescopes, like the Hubble Space Telescope and the Planck Space Observatory, have also picked this spot for their missions. Now, we all know that our Milky Way galaxy and the other galaxies we've discovered to date contain many potentially habitable planets, and with the help of JWST, we could learn more about the atmosphere of these planets. So, right after its launch into space, NASA gave the James Webb Space Telescope the green light to begin its breathtaking scientific mission. In February 2022, the JWST captured its first images of the starlight, including 18 distinct bright dots. These dots will eventually merge into a single star. But the JWST's capabilities go way beyond this. On the 18th of February 2022, JWST provided an updated and enhanced image of HD84406, 
demonstrating the growing proficiency and precision of the telescope. The initial 18 intentionally unfocused replicas of the star were arranged in a hexagonal pattern, offering a preview of the ultimate image's appearance once the observatory aligned each segment of the primary mirror. The process included stacking these images to create a singular, sharp depiction, providing scientists with a more detailed view of the star. This highlighted the telescope's remarkable precision and accuracy. Later, in July 2022, NASA revealed the first scientific images of celestial wonders like the Carina Nebula and the Southern Ring Nebula. These images, in addition to displaying their visual beauty, also showcased valuable scientific information. For example, the image of Stefan's Quintet provided new insights into how galaxies interact and the analysis of the exoplanet WASP-96b's atmosphere. Not only this, but it also provided us with a selfie. Yes, you heard it right. The JWST achieved this by using a specialized camera located within the NearCam instruments. This camera was originally intended for engineering and alignment purposes. In the selfie, one mirror was shining brighter than the others, showcasing successful alignment. Also, the JWST offered a more detailed view of the Eagle Nebula, renowned for its towering columns of gas and dust extending into space. In the latest image, the iconic pillars of creation stand tall, presenting a stunning tableau of cosmic birth. Within these pillars, numerous protostars emerge as minuscule red dots, showcasing the remarkable forces at play in this stellar nursery. This image provides a deeper insight into the dynamic processes shaping the cosmos. The JWST accomplished a remarkable milestone by providing the first ever direct image of an exoplanet. This is HIP 65426b, a gas giant with a size roughly 12 times that of Jupiter. This exoplanet is located at a huge distance from its host star, nearly 100 times more than we are from the Sun. Its huge size and distance from its host star are the factors behind the successful imaging of the exoplanet. Now, the purpose of direct imaging of exoplanets isn't just producing visually breathtaking pictures, but it is to understand the processes behind the formation of exoplanets and the composition of exoplanetary atmospheres. This scientific research holds the potential to identify exoplanets with conditions favorable for habitability. Let's be honest, the chances of finding an exoplanet with the same habitability as our planet are very low. However, the JWST, with all its capabilities, increases that chance for us, providing valuable details into the cosmos, observing some of the oldest galaxies. Speaking of the oldest galaxies, the JWST has achieved yet another stunning feat by observing the oldest galaxies known to mankind. These galaxies are located 13.4 billion light years away from us and came into formation when our universe was only 2% of its current age. These galaxies are the farthest ever observed. This achievement has given scientists a chance to study the early cosmos universe and offered valuable details about the formation of the universe. Now, pinpointing ancient galaxies that are over 13 billion years old is a big challenge due to their immense distance. Scientists use sophisticated techniques and precise observations to carefully analyze these galaxies. The JWST's capabilities played a crucial role in achieving this historic observation. The JWST's advanced infrared capabilities are crucial for detecting even the faintest signals from distant celestial bodies. It also played an important part in pinpointing and identifying four ancient galaxies. The near-infrared spectrograph on the JWST measured their red shift to determine their age precisely. A higher red shift value shows greater distance and age. These galaxies exhibited a red shift measurement of 13.2 marking their highest ever recorded. This confirmed that they are the most ancient galaxies ever observed. All in all, the JWST is an extremely flexible and powerful tool that could completely change how we understand the universe, from its ancient history to the depths of space. So, what do you think about JWST and its capabilities? Do let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching the video.